fucking move. Don't fucking move. Sit still. Me? Yeah. Get the out. Get out. Get the out. Get out. Get out. Motherfucker, I said get out. Welcome back, y'all. We got a wild one today. This one's got a lot going on. We got a dummy that flees from a traffic stop. Some of the absolute worst parenting I've ever seen. Pretty damn good parenting. And some of the most badass police officers in all of YouTube. Stick around for all three acts of today's dummy theater. It's a wild one. September 15th, 2023. An officer conducted a traffic stop on a vehicle that committed a traffic violation. Thank you, sir. Can you roll your back window down for me a little bit? Why don't you have a seatbelt on? Not funny. It's going to cost him a lot of money. Yeah, it's not, it's not funny. The reason, I, the reason I stopped you is you stopped right there on the roadway and dropped people off. You can't drop people off on the roadway. That's my problem. You have to go through like everyone That's else, right? I've been doing that every day, and I'm glad you told me. Can right, we get a license from you? And the uh, registration, please. Thank you. You have the registration for the car? That second one there. The second one was red. We went through a couple of registrations. They weren't the right ones. That's one. Yeah, it's, uh, yeah this is a good one. You're not Suzanne? No, sir. That's right. my girlfriend, sir. You don't have a... Uh, do you have a picture ID or anything? No, I don't, sir. It's at, it's at home in the wild. I was just hurt. Do you know the system. number? No, I don't, sir. Is it valid? Yes, sir. You sure? Yes, sir. All right. What's your last name? Your name, first name? Kalen. K-A-L-W-N. L-U-N. Sorry, my name. Sure? Yes, sir. Uh, What's your date of birth? Date of birth? November 20th, sir. And is there a year you're born? I don't know about y'all, but something tells me he may not be being completely honest. Alright, is there a key to this car or a key fob? Sir? We have the key fob to the car. So what's going on, sir? Why, you got, why are we doing all this, sir? Probably because you gave him a fake name and birthday. Just a hunch. Let me see the key pop. I'm saying, why are we doing all this, sir? Sir? Sir, so why are we doing sir? all this right now, sir? This don't even make no sense. Like, why are we doing all this, sir? Let me see the key pop. Sir, I'm not even going nowhere. What are we, what are we doing, sir? Just start me another unit for the Rosebud Metal, please. Is that a maroon Ford Fusion takeoff on me? Going uh, towards 15th Street, southbound. The guy driving is a complete and total idiot. The officer then headed to the house of the car's registered owner. All right. All right. This is how this is going to go. All right. You're on a video right now. You're on camera. Yes, sir. You said you just met this guy. When did you meet him? I met him off of tag. Huh? I met him off of tag. When? You met him playing tag? About a month ago. All right. We've been talking on You don't know on. his name. I don't know his full name. Not that he, he goes by here? RJ. No, he was just, he came last night. Okay. Uh, this is going to go from here to DCF. Because you're letting your children go with somebody that you don't even know, which is not safe at all. I you're telling me you don't know him. No, I was you're telling me you don't know him. He says his ID is in here. Unless I can get his ID, then you'll be, if I get his ID, you'll be out of it. All right? It's a traffic ticket. That's all it's going to be. Yeah, I, all right? I see his gray bag. I mean, right. his green bag, but I don't see nothing He's in saying, it. I need something with his name. Uh, I don't know. If you want to be out of this, get me something. 
I don't know who the guy is, and I don't even know his name, but I turned him loose in my car with my kids, because I'm smart. Okay, well, as soon as I find your car, I'm going to tow it and impound it, because it's involved in a crime. You took off from me. All right, so see how this is affecting you? Yes. It's really going to affect you with DCF, because they're going to be here. I was sick this morning. Well, That's why he's not sick now, and it's obvious. I'm, no, I'm I woke up, okay, up all right. Right this morning. No, I woke up sick, and then I got my dope, and now I'm fine. All right, I'm sorry for that, but now there's a lot more problems, okay? Um. So unless you get me his, go look for something else. He gave me his uh, red train. He didn't know how to spell his name. He didn't know the year he was born. So I asked the key fob, and he freaked out. How did he take off? Huh? Um, he backed up in the traffic. I stepped out of you, and he, if I wouldn't have jumped out of the way, you would have hit me. So I'm going to PC on him. I'm going to call DCF on her because she doesn't know who has her kids. Oh. I'm towing her car as soon as I find it because it's involved in a crime. I'm gonna... Fair enough. Yeah, it's going to be a long morning for her. You know, all right, where's your ID? I you need your ID. He stay here. That's why I don't well, you know, He have stayed here last night and he has your kids, so. Well, he came DCF last is, night because he didn't have nowhere to go. All right, let me, so have, I let him let me in. have your ID. Now she's full of shit. She oh, has yeah. your kids, right? Yeah. In her car? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I know. What do you think his name is? I'm a great mom, so you it's, it seems like it. The only way you would be a worse mom is if you unalived the children yourself. I'm not threatening with DCF. I'm telling you what I'm going to do. I know, but no threat. I ain't never had no case ever. All right. Like, well, now, unfortunately, mom. you have one. I cook. I woke up throwing up this morning, sick, yeah. and I was in my belly all night last all night. All right. What? Uh, what's um, his name? Do you think? I'm just known as RJ. RJ. I don't even know his name, but he's got my kids. Is that a first name? Is our first and last initial? What's that mean? I have no idea. How old That's is this all RJ? What they call him. I think he's like 36. They call him. Who's that? Who calls him Everybody RJ? Everybody on Tag. It's like a Tag little family. I don't know. So Tag is a website? It's a yes, dating site? Yeah. They go right. live on Tag. And you go live on tag, and you met this guy no, live on tag? I, I just go on it with my friends. I don't go live. So I how'd just, you meet him? I was in one of the lives that he was in. Oh, so you don't go live, but you were in one of the lives that he was in. I don't in. go live personally, but I go in the lives and talk in the comments. God, how many of your children did he have? I met him on the internet. I completely trust him. Huh? How many of your children did he have today? He just had my son and the uh, hey, girl's daughter. Hey, the girl's daughter. The girl's daughter. The girl's daughter. What girl's daughter? Uh, my friend's daughter that drops her off in the morning because she goes to Roosevelt. All right. How old's your child? My son's 12. What's his name? And who's the other girl that was in the car? Um, I don't even know how to spell it. And I don't Do you know, know Deanna's last, last What's her mom's last name? They used to live right here. That's all I know. I don't even know them like that either. They just moved, so she asked You don't know them like that, but they dropped the child off of your house? Sir, they what's lived across the street. Know, what's Brandy's like last name? Brand, I don't even know her like that. What house that. do they live in? They just moved out that white and green house. Did you say 23 or 26? I don't know her last name. Let her know that her daughter's in the car with someone that just took off from police and almost got in a car accident. She knows. Driving she's over. on she her knows. way to pick up her daughter now. How does she know? Now. Her daughter called her. But the cop smacked the daughter in the face. No, Did the you cop know didn't. That? No, the cop That's didn't. I was the cop. Claiming. All right, perfect. Because see, it's on so video. She Good. Just Tell her to go crying. make a police report, please. Okay, yeah. Please. She just called me crying, saying please. the cop smacked her in the face Excellent. and threw her to the side of the street. I don't know. Well, good. Maybe someone else pulled her over. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Tell me about it. Oh man. One of the girls. One of the girls that was in the car, he dropped her off down the block, and then the chick walked to school. And uh, Darnell is 10, 12. With Campbell. The girl. With the what girl. school does she go to? What, does she know his name? Yeah, Parents, don't let or force your children to get in cars with strangers. 
Is that the girl that got smacked in the face? He says to Aro's boyfriend. So it's your boyfriend. Your boyfriend? Your boyfriend? He told me he had his girlfriend's car. I like how they just claim. I don't know how. Well, I like how you I let people in your house. Like about a month ago, we've been talking on and off. He came here a couple months ago. A month ago, but you don't know his first and last name. You just know him as RJ. Right, we full, go by RJ. Full shit. How am I full shit, sir? You're full of shit. It's, if I knew it's his basic, name, I would tell you his it's name. Basic it's basic deductive reasoning. It's basic, basic deductive reasoning. We deal with people that are full of shit all the time. And if you're, you've been dating this guy for a month, you're allowing him we to take your dating. daughter you're to school. You, know, you just told me you've been dating for a month. I said I met him a month ago on tag. We've been talking here and there. We haven't, like, really got well, into the, it, like, really got Well, the kids are saying that that's your boyfriend. Now the mom's saying that's your boyfriend. You don't even know him. How I are you going to claim somebody? He's not my boyfriend. He's my dope dealer. Get it straight. I mean, they know you, right? They know me, but they've been They gone. know you they enough know. to give, to let ago. your kid go in this car with this guy. Because I've been talking to him. Like, exactly. I've, I've trusted him. Why would you trust him? Is that your boyfriend? No, it's not my boyfriend. He was doing me a favor this morning. I ate something bad last night, and it was on my stomach all night. When I woke up this morning, I was throwing up this morning. That's why he took the kids to school for me, because I was in the bathroom getting sick. So there's only one of your kids in that car? Yeah, I only have the one. No, the Bahamas. Mm-hmm. Trust me, I don't have these problems, man. Two, two, seven, I'm a great seven, mom. Seven, I don't do none of that. Six, I take care of my kids. I'm a... You keep saying that. I don't think you know what it means to be a great mom. What's a good number that DCF can contact you when they need to contact you? Um, where do you think RJ lives if he doesn't live here? As far as I know, he lives out west somewhere. Out I've west never somewhere. picked him up from there. How'd he get here? He slept here? No, he got dropped off. When? Well, he slept here last night on the couch because he came about yeah, he saw 10 o'clock. Yeah, he in the bathroom, right? Huh? He saw you sick in the bathroom, that's why he took the kids. Yeah. Okay. So he stays here, but you don't know who he he don't stay here, ma'am. He stayed here one night. And you don't know what his address is or where he lives? No, I've Anyone? never been to his house. He always got dropped off. Right. Trust me, if I knew exactly the name, I would give it to you. I don't know. I'm just saying, I wouldn't, let my, I wouldn't let my kids get into a car with some random other I don't even know his name. He's going to hate that. Yeah. Let a man in your house. Yeah. Come on, officer. Live a little. Why your kids are sleeping in there, too, right? DCF is going to hate that. Yeah. Or let a man in your house yeah. sleep for your While your kids are sleeping in there too. Do you right? have daughters? I have an older daughter. Hold on, you told me you just had one one kid. I said one kid in the car. Oh, you said you had one child. I meant one kid in the car. That's what you meant. Me. Oh, okay. How old are your other kids? My daughter's twenty two. She's a girl. That's the oldest. So you only have two children? Right. Okay. Go All right. If DCF were to take your kids, who would they bring? Who could they? Well, who could watch your kids? You have a, a family member if DCF took your kids. I'm the only one. I'm all, right. all I have. So they'd have to place them somewhere if they took them. So why would they do? Please, please place them somewhere. Get them as far away from her as you can. I'm a great. Mom. Why would they do that? Because you let some man you don't know in your house, and then you're giving me a car, and you let him take him to school. He didn't even drop up at school. He went morning. away from school. One mistake because I was sick this morning. I just would like to know who DCF I've could never did place your kids with. Wrong in my life for them to take my kids. Man. Well, I'm sure you can find some random person on the internet to place the kids with. She doesn't mind. Fully stocked with food. They got their own rooms, a clean house. I take very well good care of my kids. All right. Well, I'm going to keep your red face right now because this is evidence. Sick. I would have took my kids myself. All right. Well, he told me. It's, uh, it's on camera, too. It's funny. He told me. I, I told him not to drop off there. And he says, well, I drop off here every morning. You don't yeah. drop off every morning. Is that your car? Morning. No. I got a red car. You're a maroon car. All right. Well, um, if you want to. Well, when you get this information, if you want to make it easier on you. I would definitely give it to you. You need to I give it to me. It. Well, it, when you get it from this guy that's just going to drop off your car and leave, I'm sure. But when you get this information, if you want to give it to me, I would definitely call the police station, the non-emergency uh, number. I'll give you that number. I 
never think something like this would happen this early on. That's why, you know, we never really got into a deep conversation about ourselves. I'm not a bad mom, sir, please. You are the worst mom. My kids are my life. They come second, right behind my dope. <laughs> I made one bad judgment. All right, this is my name here. Call them, tell them you need to speak to Officer Lemoyne. Officer Lemoyne will call you. You'll give me that information. Hopefully before DCF gets here. Yes, sir. Hi. How you doing? Good, how are you? Is it okay if I talk to her yeah, for a second? Good, good morning. You're in the back of the car, right? When I t who who ripped you out of the car? No, I didn't say that. Oh. Because I said because I thought you were trying to get me out of the car because you tried to stop it because he was trying to drive off in the traffic with me. And then halfway down the street, he told me to get out the car. Oh, okay. So nobody ripped you out of the car. No. No officer ripped you out of the no. car. Oh, I, I thought you told somebody they did. No, I said I thought you tried to. Okay. Who, who was this that was driving the car? Um, her boyfriend. But, uh, who was it? Um, the, the lady boyfriend, Mr. Zan boyfriend. What's his name? I don't know. You don't know his name? No. Okay, why'd you get in the car with him? Because she, I don't know, she was, um, she told me to, um, go in because I needed a ride to school because my mama don't let me walk. All right, so how's the last, when's the last time you took a ride to school with him, driving? Today. Today is the only time? Yeah. Huh? Yes. You've never been in the car with him driving before. It's not a hard question. Just the yes first or no. Day of school and then yes or no. No, it's not. Me. I took you the first day of school. So honestly, you better tell these people the truth, bro. I don't want to get out their face. I I want to go to work. And you said he lied. First, you said they slapped you in the face. Then you said they grabbed you out the car. Get her, mom. Make up your mind, Zayana. I you see how she steady changing the story? First the officer slapped her. The story. Then the officer took out the car. Now ain't none of that happened. I tell, never tell them what happened. You I never said that. Get out of the car. So you honestly, you said they knocked the, the, the necklace so, off and yes, everything. Yes, he did. I touched you. Lying. I touched you. Did I touch you? When you reached into the car, did you I touch take you? Her to jail. Take her oh, to jail. Did I touch you? Or see, that's a good mom. Take her to jail. Take her to jail. My mom would have took me and dropped me off the jail herself. The whole time I'd have been begging the cops to take me instead. Your clothes. Somebody took my leg off my neck because I don't have it. I had it when I was in the car when you told me to put on my seatbelt. Okay, so don't wait, wait. Answer this question. Stop, please. This is a yes or no question. Did I touch you or did I touch your clothes? My lanyard, yes. When you tried to grab Remember, grab this the camera thing. was on. When you grabbed the thing. Grab what thing? The um the window thing when you tried to stop the car, you tried to stop the car because he was he was driving off. Okay, and I touched you? When you just remember it's on camera, so we're gonna be able to look at it and watch it. Alright. Go let's go back to the last question. When's the last time you got a ride to school with him? I don't remember. Last week? Last week? No. She took me all last week. All right. So more than more than a week ago? Honestly. Yeah. All right. And you rode with him. You said this was the first time you rode with him. Can you stop? Yes. You, you rode with him another time from no. here. No. No. No, I'm not. I just said this is the first time. because she's lying. And I'm dealing with these people because of her. I'm doing it like that because she's lying. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. You saw those Can you stop, please? Can you stop? No, ma'am. You're not in any trouble, all right? I'm just trying to figure out what, what happened. Trying to figure out who this guy is, all right? He gives you guys a ride to school, that's fine. It's no, not... this, is his, this is my first time getting a ride, I mean, getting a ride from him. But why did you tell me three minutes ago that he gave you a ride on the first day? You told me that. And then no. you said it was later than that. No, this is the first time. But it's not. 
because when a couple, you know, like it was like in the, like in August, she was in, she was driving the car though. Oh, but he was in the car. Yeah, he was on the passenger. Oh, seat. all right, all right, that's different. So he didn't give you rides. Well, no. she gave you rides. Well, and yeah, he was but in the car. today, okay. but today he gave us a ride because okay. I don't think she was feeling good today. Okay, he lives here with her. I don't know. But I don't, he's usually I here don't when you come. Here. All right. Well, you usually no, when you come is, in the morning. This is like he don't live with her at all. Okay. This is like this is like my second time seeing him. That's it. Second time doing what? Seeing him, like, okay. because when I came the other day, he wasn't here at all. Okay. Did you, did you get hurt or anything today? Yeah. Were you scared? What are you? What were you scared of? Because I didn't want to get in. I thought I was going to get in trouble because I was in the car with him. But what else? When he took off like that, were you scared of the way he was driving? I thought he was going to hit other people. All right. Did you think he was going to hit me? Yes. Pretty close, wasn't it? Yeah. I thought he did. Huh? I thought he did. You thought he hit me? Okay. Well, luckily he didn't. All right. All right. You're all set. You can go, okay? okay. Thank you. 26. 29. Yeah, yeah, she's good. Appreciate I'm just trying to figure out who this is. You know who it is? Nah, I ain't even talking. Ain't about them girls. I don't play about them girls. We, I just got a call say she done got snatched out the car and high speed chase. That's all I heard. Mm -hmm. You're gone. Well, she did not. I, I never even, I never touched her. It's all on video, which is fine. Right. But she shouldn't be with whoever this guy is. Yes, sir. You know, you need to be watch who you're right. trusting. Good things happen. You can't trust this lady. Right. All right? Right. Okay. Thank you. All right. I'll give you one more chance. If you can give me his information before I get it. Listen, listen. Can I, can I, I let me finish? Let me finish. Right if you can give me his information before I get it or before DCF comes over here, then you can be out of it. All right? I'm right now, you're dead in the middle of it. I'm trying. All right? And I'm going to take your car because it's evidence in a crime. All right? Because I might need to get his DNA because we don't know who this person is. All right. Okay. Thank you. A month. Now we get to the good stuff. This is like a narcotics task force or something. They ain't playing around. Later, officers found the man in the same vehicle with the same woman at a gas station. They suspected that he was doing a drug deal. Don't move. Don't move. Sit still. Four or five cops in plain clothes with their tactical vests and their guns drawn come running at a car you were just at, and they tell you to go, go. You don't want to stick around for that. You got any dope on you? you smell like weed. No? You just walked into a shit storm. You just mind your fucking business. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Get the fuck out of my face. Get the fuck out of my face. Because I'll take you to fuck around and find out. Oh, poor you. Bring your knees up to the chest. Poor you. So sorry that you just got started. You need paramedics? Yeah, I just picked up. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. Come to me. Get out of here! What are you doing in this car? What do you got in that bag? What's in the bag? My, that's my bag. Why are you what leaning you in the window for 20 minutes counting shit on the pillow? No, because he was, um, he's sick. Hey, you don't talk to Snoop that way. Show some respect. What's the feeling good? So you think I'm stupid? Are you serious? I'm dead ass serious. Does this look like the Mickey Mouse crew? ID. No, no it does. Give me your ID. You too. Turn the car off. Hey. 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 Get up. Ain't no problem, bro. And you got a knife right there on the ground like you're going to do something. It's handstand. What is that? Yeah, that's my knife. 
You you were about to get it, brother. You go right over here and sit down on the curb. No problem. You just, you just open yourself a whole shit storm. Sit down. What are you doing hanging out at a gas station in the middle of the night anyway? Well, you about to go for doing some damn dope. Huh? Why are you leaning in this car? Why are you leaning in the car? Why are you leaning in the car? You're not telling me anything. I'm asking you why. You don't want to hear my answer. Your answer is bullshit. Are you a medic? Are you a paramedic? Are you a paramedic? Do you have any medical training? What's your fucking name? RJ, bro. His name is RJ. His name is RJ. No, it's not. Good try. So he's not your friend. You don't even know his name. Or you can look at me crazy all you want. Yellow shirt guy's staying fairly calm considering the situation he's in. I gotta give him props for that. Because he could have escalated that. And you know the officers would have escalated it a lot more. So good job staying calm. Way to go, buddy. All you want. When I tell you to get the out of here, next time you get the out of here. Where's your ID at? You don't have an ID. How old are you? You're 48, and you don't have an ID. So why don't you have an ID on you? Are you a child? Children have IDs on you. Come to the gas station, get black and mild, and then go back to the high. So why don't you have an ID on you? Because I'm not committing no crime. We're doing no That's not what I said. I said, why don't you have an ID on you? In the United States, you need to have a, an identification card on you with a picture and your name Only on it. Only if you get caught in a crime and I need to present you an ID. I right. Need no crime. You're, no you have a reasonable, articulable suspicion that you're involved in a narcotics deal at this car because I sat here for 20 minutes and watched you. Your behavior is consistent. Your behavior is consistent with selling narcotics. Hey, boss, if, you, if that's what you want to do, go ahead and take me to this. I can call my lawyer. Oh, bro, I don't have to, I don't have to be told to do anything by no you. Problem. That oh, believe me, believe me. You can me. take me to jail. You understand oh, what I'm saying? Oh, I know what I can and can't yeah, do. you can take me to jail. No, I can't. You understand what I'm saying? Because I haven't got your name yet. I'm, I'm giving, that's what I'm giving it to you. Well, I have to write it down. Oh, okay. What's your first name? Reginald. Yeah, you, when I tell you to walk off, you're interfering with me walking up behind us and shit? Bro, I'm done talking to you. I'm done talking to you. I'm done talking to you. She called me and said he passed out. Now you can stand with me. I'm checking on him. That's a concern. We're telling you to leave. We're telling you to leave. Bro, this is the, the, Bro. yeah. This is probably the same guy that was walking around smoking a blunt earlier too. But you have a, a profound misunderstanding of what a Terry stop is and what a reasonable, articulable suspicion is. You just go. Don't stick around. If you see, but I know that you see, came from a doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. You see four cops. He's not getting it. He don't get it. He don't get it. You jump four cops get into a car. He did something, right? It's a very apparent. We didn't just. Roll up. He's laid down in the back seat, and we knew where he was. But we seen it when they came in. Don't matter. Bro, oh, you matter. don't get it. You don't get it, dude. You're 48 years old. You don't get it. We didn't jump out plain clothes. We got this. We've been looking at you. We don't want to have serious. What we do is we look at the back of the I'm so sick of you, and I'm so sick of him. You get a one. By our name and DOD. Oh, of course, of course. First name is Reginald. Common spelling. At least the kids wasn't with her this time. Or she was there and the kids weren't. She's a liar. She's a drug addict. She's full of shit. Yep. Oh my god, I didn't know what I was saying. I just picked up and passed out at the fucking, uh, what is that, the buffet place? Buttonate on the goddamn door. I don't know what it was. 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 I know who you are. Now you know who I am. And the next time I tell you to get away from my crime scene, no, 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 boss man, none of that. Fuck up. The next time I don't give a shit. I don't give a shit. You disrespected me by putting my safety in danger by walking up behind me. I still right there when you told me to stay right there, boss man. I can understand you doing your job. 
Respect a dude to a dog, man. Stop. I don't I'm respect a grown you. Man, I don't like give you. a fuck if you're a so grown man. So you don't respect me? No. Don't take me to jail, no, bro. I've been seeing him belittle me like I done did something wrong, bro. You're free to go. Goodbye. I appreciate you, boss. Have a good day, man. Yeah, I appreciate you. I will be seeing you. No problem. I will be seeing you. No problem. Just stay out of stay out of the streets with these idiots and you'll yeah. never see me again. Hey, I do for trucks. I'm a contractor, boss. Yeah, oh, you ain't coming around my house. <laughs> Yeah, go contract somewhere else. After interviewing him, he was transported to a different facility. You are all set. We stand up. I'm going to cuff you up. Mr. Williams. Hey, you're all set. Can you stand up? I'm ready to transport. <laughs> Feeling any better? Yeah, that's good. That's good. Can you turn around? <sighs> Please get some food in you. I think you missed dinner time at the county, so at least you got something good to eat in you. There you have it. Like I said, there's a lot going on in that one. Be sure and like, subscribe, leave a comment. We'll see you next time.